right, how's it going? We're gonna try something a little bit different today. I am going to watch a performance video from myself and Eric Krasnow with the Krasnow Moore Project, and this was filmed live in Pittsburgh. And this isn't so much a reaction video as more of a comment video. I'm gonna watch us play and I'm gonna comment on what I'm playing and maybe why I played certain things the way I did or maybe where some of the things that I'm playing in this video are coming from. So I think that this might be kind of a fun way to get a little bit of an insight as to what it is that I'm doing and the approach that I'm taking. So let's go ahead and jump into this video. This was filmed by my good buddy and my main videographer, Big Stan Zlotkowski, and he lives in the Erie, Pennsylvania area. So he came and filmed this when we played in Pittsburgh. So let's jump into watching this video and I'm gonna comment a little bit and uh, let y'all know what's going on from my perspective. All right, what's happening? How's everybody doing? Excellent. Well, we'll talk to y'all a little bit as we go, but uh, right now I think we're just gonna get started playing. Is that cool? That's definitely a little bit of a nod to Zigabur Modaliste. The fill leading into this melody. So that's a little bit of a homage to some normal second line stuff, maybe a little bit of Harlan Riley. This tune was written by Eric Krasno and is an homage to Jeff Beck and the year 1976 when Jeff Beck came out with a couple different records that were very influential. And right there, there's an extra bar leading into this B section.
diddle diddle with the bottom engine underneath. And let me say with that, I like to lock up with the soloist and sometimes play rhythmically something that fits with what they do. Some players don't like to do that. They like to play something that is contrary. But sometimes, occasionally, I like to lock in with a rhythmic idea that the soloist is playing. something that I was feeling in the moment. I didn't quite nail it that time. But when I do something like that, I make a point to go shed it and then until the next time that I go for that, that I've got it. Some Stanton sweeps there. I always like to play something super obvious and look at everybody and let everybody know, here we go, coming back. That's a fun little hit that we only do on the last A section out. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Stanton Moore on the drums to my left, everybody. There you have it. So yeah, if y'all have some questions that you would like me to address that I didn't talk about in here. I didn't want to talk over the whole thing. But if you have some questions about maybe something I was playing, uh, maybe you want to mark exactly at what minute and second marking that you're talking about, I'd be happy to answer some of that. And I will be checking these comments below and I will be answering any questions y'all might have. So yeah, this is uh, hopefully something that will give y'all a little insight into into some of what I'm doing, some of the way that I'm approaching some things. So thanks for tuning in. And if you found this informative or helpful, please do like this video. Also hit that notification bell so you will be notified when I am coming out with other videos. And sometimes I'm doing lessons, sometimes I'm doing behind the scenes stuff. And if y'all dig this, I'll do some more of this. And then also please do subscribe to my channel because I will be posting a lot more videos in the near future. So thanks a lot y'all and I'll see y'all down the line. Yes indeed!